The black card is here. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Milwaukee, Wisconsin. Weighing in at 201 pounds, Tommaso Ciampa! Had a tremendous relationship with longtime best friend Johnny Gargano before he decided that championships are more important than friendship. It was then and only then I realized how intelligent Tommaso Ciampa truly is. It's not about friendships, it's about making money and winning titles. Yeah, Champa had no problem allowing his selfish desires to rise to the forefront. His selfish desires are what propelled Tommaso Champa to the position that he's in today. Complete and utter contempt for the NXT universe. Oh, believe me, the feeling is mutual. I wonder what the legendary Harley Race, the man who trained Tomasa Ciampa, thinks about his attitude today. Harley Race is a tough guy, one of the toughest to ever do this. I'm sure Harley's very proud of what Ciampa's accomplished. One of the toughest men in WWE. And his opponent from Boston, Massachusetts, weighing in at 190 pounds, Oni Lorcan. This guy is embarrassing to watch on social media, but he is fun to watch in the ring. One of the best tag team competitors in NXT, moved to 205 Live, where he has quickly risen in the cruiserweight division. The vicious, remorseless, unforgiving Tommaso Ciampa. He will do whatever it takes to win, which often pushes his opponents to do the same thing, usually to disastrous results for all those involved. Settle in, guys. This is going to be a blast to watch. Definitely has his work cut out for him. He's in full control now. You know, record Lariat. What a combination. And Tommaso Ciampa slips out of harm's way. Tommaso Ciampa is a maniacal, vicious, and downright dangerous superstar. But he always has a target on his body in the form of his surgically repaired right knee. Wow. Saxton, I'm impressed. Suggesting Ciampa's opponent take a shortcut to victory. Uh, I'm not suggesting that. I'm just saying that anyone who's in the ring with Ciampa should be aware of his weakness. Because there's no doubt he's aware of theirs and will exploit them at any moment. There's hyperbole, and then there's Tommaso Ciampa. He's actually taken to calling himself the greatest sports entertainer of all time. And what evidence do you have to the contrary? Because the case for that name includes an NXT Tag Team title, an NXT Championship that he never lost, and, oh yeah, countless Match of the Year candidates. What a brutal display by Ciampa. He's gaining the upper hand here. Air Raid Siren. I don't know how you survive that. We're gonna see it! Woo-wee! Guys, Tommaso Ciampa taking full advantage. Byron, I gotta say, Corey made a great case for Tommaso Ciampa. 
as the greatest sports entertainer of all time. With all those accolades, he may just be the best in-ring competitor in NXT history. Well, I'm going to hold off on calling him the greatest sports entertainer of all time. For now, he's the most, how about, uh, egotistical sports entertainer of all time. We're gonna see it! Oh, a knee! Lights out. He's struggling a bit here. He's lost much of his early confidence. Jamba looking for the takedown. There it is! Bridging Fujiwara! Cinching it in! Look at the torque on the shoulder. Oh! He's just about there. Submission. Color me surprised, Michael. I did not see that one coming. Vicious, aggressive attacks. And Tommaso Ciampa slips out of harm's way. Look out here. Down with a power bomb. This superstar is digging down deep. His superstar giving him... Nope, not this time. Champa! Very tail end there. This is his chance. Will he seize the moment? It'll be hard. Tommaso Ciampa wins! Tommaso Ciampa wins! These gentlemen get after it. Here are the highlights. Yeah, you can bet they're going to be talking about this match for quite some time.